हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू माई नेक्स्ट क्लास इन दिस क्लास वील सी टू आइडेंटिटीज एंड टू प्रॉब्लम्स बेस्ड ऑन दो टू आइडेंटिटीज यू कैन सी हियर द आइडेंटिटीज ही आर हियर आइडेंटिटी नाइनटीज एक्स क्यूब प्लस वाई क्यूब इज इक्वल टू एक्स प्लस वाई इन टू एक्स स्क्वायर माइनस एक्स वाई प्लस वाई स्क्वायर दीज टू ब्रैकेट्स आर ऑल्सो कंसिडर एज फैक्टर्स ऑफ एक्स क्यूब प्लस वाई क्यूब दिस इज एक्सपेंशन ऑफ दिस आइडेंटिटी एज वेल एज वी कैन कंसिडर इट एज फैक्टर्स ऑफ एक्स क्यूब प्लस वाई क्यूब कीप इन माइंड दिस इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट the identities are very useful when you are in 10th standard so you should write the both the identities five five times that is homework now based on this we have two problems today so we will solve it we'll start it now 27 can be written as 3 q 3 3 is a 9 9 3 is a 27 So twenty seven can be written as three cube. I am writing three cube into y cube plus one twenty five can be written as five cube student. Five five is a twenty five and twenty five five is a one twenty five and z cube as it is. Now I can write three cube into y cube as three y whole cube. Plus, this can be written as five z whole cube. Now, this is in the form of x cube plus y cube. Here, x is three y and y is five z. Now, we will first write the identity. The identity which is useful here, the identity which is useful is x cube plus y cube. Is equal to x plus y into x square minus x y plus y square. Now we'll write our question. That is three y whole cube plus five z whole cube. Now in our case, x is three y and y is five z. We have to put x is equal to three y and y is equal to five z. Here in the expansion, we'll get the answer. Now x is three y, so three y plus y is five z in the bracket. X square x is three y, so it will be three y whole square minus again x is three y into y is into y is five z. Then plus y square y is five z, that is five z whole square. Then bracket close is equal to three y plus five z as it is. Now, three y whole square. Three square is nine. Y square is y square minus three five is a fifteen. Y into z is y z. It will be fifteen y z plus five square is twenty five, and z square. This is the answer for this question. We factorize twenty seven y cube plus. One twenty-five z cube. This is the answer. We'll see one more question today. Okay, this is from the exercise. Keep in mind question number ten. Two questions are there. First, we have solved. This is second one. Now, first we have to convert these two in the form of x cube minus y cube. This can be converted. So, sixty-four uh, can be written as four cube. M cube as it is minus three forty three can be written as seven cube into n cube. 
Now this we can combine it like this 4m whole cube minus 7n whole cube. Now this is in the form of a x cube minus y cube. We'll write the identity. That identity is useful here. x cube minus y cube is equal to x minus y into x square plus x y that is the useful identity I am writing x y plus y square now we will write our question 4m whole cube minus 7n whole cube is equal to in place of x we have 4m and in place of y we have 7n we have to put x is equal to 4m we have to substitute x is equal to 4m and y is equal to 7m let's substitute it x is 4m 4m minus y is 7n into bracket x square 4m whole square plus xy 4m is x into y is 7n plus y square is 7n whole square bracket close now again this 4m minus 7n as it is into bracket 4 square is 16 m square is m square 4 7 is 28 28 into m into n is mn plus 7 square is 49 n square is n square so this is the answer for this question these are the factors two factors for 64 m cube minus 343 n cube i hope you understood if you have any doubt you can write in the comment section don't forget to like subscribe Share and subscribe the channel Mathematics Classes. Thank you for watching.